outnumbered. It won't be long until Malik turns his armada loose on Coruscant itself. Save your empty threats, Sith scum. Malik isn't stupid enough to attack the core worlds, now with the entire Republic fleet waiting for him. You're a fool. When the Sith descend on Coruscant, our numbers will block out the sun itself. The galactic senators will collapse trembling in fear and beg for mercy at Malak's feet. You underestimate the Republic's resolve. We'll die before we surrender Coruscant. That can be arranged. Remember what happened to Taris. Malak could do the same to the core worlds. He wouldn't dare. Now it is you who underestimate our resolve. How much for all this stuff, Tybark? Chiwi Aita ka chong chi cha. Agi inko tune chuna muri ra. Tongi wama chiko na. Tong ki pa nonku nek abog. Thanks, Tybark. Catch you next week. Chiwi Aita ka chong chi cha. Agi inko tune chuna muri. Just cranky to pets nemo. Chua Penti, Yun Patisa. Only. You gotta pay a 20 credit toll to walk down this street. Hiding behind the Selkath laws. Typical Republic cowards. Hook to Dax is insane. He just smashes through everything to the finish. I guess we should expect that from a Gamorrean.
Kipuna na bonsha kava dumpa takom justak mi tongai tuam jij takom kachi chuai sa odunga inkin kuno ba mulira tak tongai tongai tuam jij yumali kava takom inki. Tong hai tuam jiji yumalis pa taku Much We might have a position within the civil organization for one such as you. Your offer is pretty good. But I've heard some nasty things about you, Sith. Is it true you bombed Terrus and the dust? This is war. In war, certain distasteful acts cannot be avoided. But ask yourself this, when we win this war, would you rather be against the Sith or with us? You make a good point. And I've never turned down a job that pays in front. Excellent. Report to the Sith Embassy tomorrow for your assignment. I have no desire to... Sorry, but you're too late to... Re And why are you bothering me? I'm here on Manand. Sorry, but you... I don't have... Sorry, but you're too... Hey, keep your lectures. You got any armor plating for my spook bike? I thought this garbage was free. Don't worry, junk man. Only people who have business with the... Ha! We know who we have business with. Go. Stay. Doesn't matter to me. If you want to, you can even wander up to the embassy gates. <laughs> but don't expect to get inside.
Welcome to Manan. I'm Roland Wong. As the official representative of the Republic Embassy on this planet, I'm here to help all citizens of the Republic should they require aid. Colto is a precious resource. Its healing powers are near miraculous. During times of war, Colto becomes even more valuable. As long as we have the permits, we will continue to harvest Colto and ship it to our Republic soldiers battling against the Sith. Of course, the Sith enjoy the very same privileges. If there was some way we could gain an edge over the Sith and our Colto supply, but the Selkath are fiercely protective of their neutrality in this conflict. They do not want to grant either side an advantage. Oh, of course. Of course, I'll do whatever I can. But I'm only a simple diplomatic representative of the Republic. I doubt I can be of any use to the Jedi Council. An ancient and forgotten race. And you think it may be here on Manan? Hmm. Well, perhaps. But if you want to get information about that, you'll have to do something for me first. No, no. You do what I want and maybe I can help you out. Until then, nothing. We were using a submersible reconnaissance droid in the ocean surrounding Otto City, and it was... damaged. It took a data recording of the outside of the city before being driven off by the Firaxan sharks. But while it was returning to the surface, it encountered difficulties and was disabled. Its automatic systems floated it to the surface, but we could not retrieve it in time. The Sith were applying subtle pressure to the Selkath authorities for some reason we've not determined, and were able to delay us long enough that they could retrieve the droid before we did. The droid's data centers are heavily encrypted, so it will take the Sith several days, we believe, to get to its data. It was captured 12 hours ago. It is imperative that we get it back. It's heavily guarded, we're sure, in the Sith Embassy here on Manan. Since we have no remaining soldiers to spare, and certainly not our elite ones, we have no one capable of entering the Sith base and retrieving it. That is what we would ask you to do. There are several leads we've been working on to get into the Sith base. Any of them should work for you, although it might be wise to concentrate your efforts on just one. The first method that's possible is to help us interrogate a Sith prisoner we managed to catch after he tried to infiltrate our base. He's being held just inside our enclave. We think he may be able to give us the passcode that the Sith give their informers to enter the base. He has proved most resilient so far. Good. It's a logical place to start. But you should also hear about the other options available to you. We managed to pick up a crate of blank Sith data cards, the type they use for pass cards. The encryption system to unlock them is very difficult, however. But if you are more skilled than our technicians, you may be able to gain access that way. The Sith have got the Seldkath to give them exclusive use of one of the main hangar bays. Visiting Sith Masters use this bay to land, then take a speeder over the water to an external entrance to the Sith Enclave. The luckless spy we mentioned earlier had a pass card to that hangar on him. While it is surely well guarded, it may prove to be the most direct route. Here's the card. The Sith base itself is very heavily guarded. If they became aware of your presence, I fear you would be quickly outnumbered and killed. Here is a pass card to get you inside our facility. You should find all you need to get started in there. You can choose whichever of the methods you want as long as you get in the base and get the data recording back. Which method do you think you would like to try first? Good call. Just make sure you don't push him too hard or we might lose him. I wish you luck in your task. Should you retrieve the data recording from the droid, return it here to me and we can see about getting you that information. So, you're the one Roland has got to help us interrogate this prisoner. I hope your Jedi powers will come in. He's a Sith spy we picked up a little while ago, snooping around outside trying to get in. We thought he was suspicious and brought him inside when the Selkath weren't looking. But it seems the Sith have done a pretty good job of conditioning this guy, and we haven't been able to break him yet. The Sith protect their really important spies with some sort of mental force feedback system. They can turn their minds in on themselves, so force compulsions won't affect them. Combine this with conventional training to resist interrogation, and sometimes it takes months to get them to tell what they know. Do you want to interrogate him now? While the training the Sith gave him will protect him from most normal interrogation techniques, and also from force persuasion, 
We have found a few hooks you might find useful. He was with another man when he was first spotted. We think it was another spy, but we didn't manage to catch him. We also seized some personal documents he had on him when he was captured. It would seem that he's married to a woman named Tila. We checked this in our computers, and it seems to hold up. We've sent a couple of agents to investigate, but it may be a while. What we have here is your standard issue truth serum. It should make him spill his guts in no time. But there is a catch. Because of his conditioning, he's able to resist it at small doses. But if you give him too much, his body realizes what you're trying to do and shuts his mind down completely. If you do that, you'll have to inject him with an antidote that neutralizes the truth serum. Unfortunately, that too is a drawback. It causes short-term memory loss. This may work to your advantage because you can try the same tactic over and over again. But if you use it too much, he may forget everything we want to know. Shall we get it started then? No problem. You're back. Let's... Boy, what do you want? You're not. <laughs> you... Lies. You work for... The Sith will never trust you again, Spy. We're the only place you have left. Tell us what we want to know. Never. I... There's nothing you... Ha. <laughs> worth my while. The Sith don't pay very well. But they'd kill me. Boy, what do you want? What? What companion? The gutless Sith worm is already starting to crack. We'll have what we need within hours. Ha! Ah, the Sith are stronger than you. Of course, they would never believe we let you go so easily. But they would all too happily believe you betrayed them. The Sith are no nothing you could or Tila. You think Ha No Damn Or Or No The Gutless Pete Of course this or You think there's not the Sith will never never or giving up so soon? So you're the one who's gonna try to get into the Sith base, eh? Huh, good luck, you're gonna need it. This is our main computer room here. We got the box of pass cards we got from the Sith, but we haven't been able to break their encryption yet. We have been able to decode the numeric system they use, but there are holes in our terminal sequence patterns. The strings of numbers that end the code sequences. If we could... The encryption system is composed of six matrices. Each is based on a mathematical method. The holes we're missing... Most are simple, but... The second last matrix has a pattern looping back on itself, or something. And the but I have to admit, all this is a bit over my head. I haven't even been able to slice past the first matrix. I've, I've ruined a dozen cards already. Since Roland said you were cleared, you can use the computer free.
Encryption schema. We've managed to decrypt. If you think you're, can I help? You? Okay. Can I help you with anything? The Sith encryption scheme on these cards is based on a sequence of. We've managed to decode the majority of the encryption algorithm, but the final segments of the terminal sequences elude us. If you think you're able, you can try to break the code on the card. Don't worry if you happen to ruin the card. The box we captured has a whole bunch of them. Can I help you with anything? Okay.
You stop. Can I help you with anything? Okay. You're back. Let's... Uh. What? No, please don't. You think... Br what? What? Nothing. The gutless... He would... What? You're not... The Sith will not... Never... There's n You think... What? What? Of course they... <sighs> Damn! Uh, what? You're not... The Sith will... Ne you think... What? You're not... There's nothing... What? You think bro... No! Please don't hurt her! Please. All right. What's the pa- It's... It's Zeta 2456988 Alpha. Just no more. Good. With this pass, you should be able to get into the Sith base without trouble. Just don't delay too long or they might learn that he's been captured. Have you managed to retreat? Time? Sorry, but ever since the murder... This old Republic war hero by the name of Sunri was seeing the Sith woman here, Alasa. Well, they were seeing each other, but the other night a blaster went off in one of the rooms. Sunri got seen leaving the place, and the Sith woman was dead on the floor. But not everyone thinks this Sunri did it. So the Selkath are holding him in prison, while the case gets sorted out. In the meantime, they closed down my hotel. But enough about my problems. You can't stay here while the investigation is on. You'll have to find someplace else to stay. Sorry.
Sorry, buddy, but the hotel ever since the A what? Me? Oh, but since the murder ha this o well, but not but not We have a deal? That's an awful lot of money. Is there something you're not telling me? Don't be so suspicious. The Republic is generous. We pay our mercenaries well. Makes sense, I guess. All right, I'm in. When do I start? Just show up at the Republic Embassy tomorrow and speak to our representative there. I'm sure I'll have some task he wants you to start on right away. I'm in the middle of a Republic recruiting drive right now. I need to hire these mercenaries before they s I don't know if you've got what we're looking for. Jedi aren't generally suited to mercenary work. If you want, talk to Roland Wan at the Republic. It's north of here, just eat. Now if you'll respects the peace of Otto City, Your Honor. But the Sith are a violent people who leave violence in their wake. I have three soldiers in the infirmary. If the Republic's soldiers were more capable, they would not have suffered such serious injuries. Are my soldiers to be punished simply because they won a fair fight? I hardly call six against three a fair fight. The Sith are cowards who attack only when they have the advantage of numbers. <laughs> They were provoked, Your Honor. The Sith goaded them into this fight.
Manon should treat us Sith. The Selkath have forgotten. Why can't the Selk... Comfortable with spying on the Republic, but if if we could assure the Selkath that they mean no harm, then perhaps. And what if the Republic does mean harm, Karth? Will you tell them? If the Republic did mean harm to the Selkath, then I want to know what the Selkath did to provoke it. How very noble of you. <laughs> No desire to speak to you. You're new around here, aren't you? My name's Duan. Care to buy a Sith girl a drink? That is, unless you're... Well, some of the soldiers like to go and bet on the swoops on their day off, but this planet is bad enough without mingling with the locals. But I don't really want to talk about that right now. I'm... We Sith are interested in a lot of things. If you're smart, but I don't really want to talk about that. Oh, come on. What's the matter? Afraid I'll drink you under the table? Seems I'm not ladylike enough for some men. Well, I may be a woman, but I'm still... Oh, it's you again. I probably should cut back on the drinking. But it's a good way to relax. But I don't really want to talk about... You some kind of... His it isn't easy here, you know, but I don't... Oh, come on. Seems up. Hey, man. Clear out. The cramping. Hey, man. Clear out. The cramping my style with the ladies. Hey, man. Clear. I am not for hire. Perhaps the Mandalorian or the Achani can help you. Yeah. Hey. 
I hope you're here to play some Paza. Tongi tua ma aki tu tu ne, potongi tua ma ji aki tu tu. 
Tong, Isca do Soki, Topa, Bono Nakachi, Tambora na Wi. Tong, Hidwama Aki, Inko Tune, Totong, Hidwama Ji Aki, Inko Tung, Isca do Soki, Topa, Bono Nakachi. Kiwak and Aita can Kichana, Tukornipo. Un muri ras nino poi wanga Tong Tuama ji human act in Ika tune Tong ki Tuama act in Tuko tune O Tong ki Tuama ji aki Kiska do soki Kopa bono nakachi Labora na winti smak toma Kuyami kiska do soki Tong ki Tuama act in Tuko tune O Tong ki Tuama ji aki Tuko tune Tong pano kun no nek chiwi aita ka chong chicha ki muli wa tiska do soki kopa bono nakachu labora na winti smak toma uyami kyusku chika nai uchu apenki Tong ki tuama aki inko kune o tong ki tuama chi aki inko kun tong pano kun no nek Chiwi Aita Ka Chong Chi Cha Agi Uko Tune Chuna Muli Ra Tong Hi Tuama Aki Uko Tune Chiwi Chiwa Diska Do Soki Kopa Bono Tong Hi Tuama Aki Uko Tune Tong Hi Tuama Ji Aki Uko Tune Diska Do Soki Kopa Bono Nakachu Amora na winti smak chiwi aita ka chon chicha Agi uko tune chuna muli wa Tong hi tuama jiko na Tong hi tuama aki uko tune O tong hi tuama ji aki uko tune Tong pa no kun no Diska no soki Topa po top diska Tong hi tuama aki uko tune O tong hi tuama ji aki uko tune Tong pa no kun no nek Chiwi aita ka chong chicha Ki mu Diska do soki Kopa bono nak Tong hi tuama aki inko tune O tong hi Diska do soki Kopa bono nakachu Labora na winkis Tong hi tuama aki inko tune Diska do soki Kopa bono nak Thank you.